Materials required for candle and glass experiment are as follows. Candle, glass, matchstick, timer, a wooden bowl. The procedure here is to place the candle on the wooden bowl, keep the matchbox and the glass ready, light the candle, leave it for some time, close the candle with the glass tumbler so you can see through the light. After a few seconds you can see flame comes down slowly and eventually goes off. You can try opening the glass when the flame is low and see how it picks up oxygen again and the flame goes higher. You can also see a small sediment of moisture in the inner walls of the glass. That is a proof that fire releases H2O. Use of timer is of immense value because kids can understand the time taken for the light to go off after closing the candle with glass. It can be further extended by using candles of different sizes, by using the glass of different sizes and accordingly checking the time. You can use bigger and smaller glass together with different candles to check and do an experiment based on different sizes of candles, different sizes of the glass. Various age groups have various learnings from this particular experiment. If your child is under 5, it can only understand that oxygen is required for a candle to burn. And when we close the glass tumbler, oxygen goes off and hence the candle. A 5 to 6 year old can experiment this by noting time and they can learn how much oxygen is required to burn candle. They can learn about smoke and wax also. If your child is 8 plus, they can learn the chemical equations, balancing them and a detailed science behind the candle and a glass experiment. Primary objective is to teach the role of oxygen in fire and explain the presence of oxygen in air.